This is a $1,000 WWE action figure mystery box. You're probably wondering why it looks like it fell down a flight of stairs. Well, it's because I actually pulled that out of my garage. You see, this is no normal mystery box. I searched the depths of the internet and nowhere sold a complete WWE or wrestling action figure mystery box. So with the help of my wife, hover, hover. me and her searched out the internet, spent $1,000, and accumulated this box full of collectibles that we're going to unbox today. Now, this did happen a few weeks ago, and I just got back from WrestleMania, so I cannot remember half of what is in this box. But what's also awesome is everything inside this box that we pull out here today is going to be available for sale. So stay tuned for details. On top of that, we have an epic giveaway item and some awesome mystery items. With that being said, man, let's unbox this thing and find out what we have in here. Now, I did get my wife to kind of package this up because, I, again, I don't remember exactly what we have in here. But I do want to keep it somewhat of a mystery, so I'm going to, like, lift it up a little bit. You know, I want to pull things out one by one and showcase what we have in here. Now, this one right here, we're going to wait to the end to open this because this is a special envelope. This is the super special awesome envelope. This is so totally super special awesome. All right, man, let's get into our first figure here, man. And we do have the... Monday Night Wars Stone Cold Steve Austin Elite figure right here. Beautiful looking figure. We know about the first few sets now, but this figure was awesome. This was my favorite figure out of this entire set. I know a lot of people are struggling to find this figure, so this is a good one to pick. Our next figure that we have is going to be one of my favorite Rey Mysterio figures of all time, and this is the Rey Mysterio Top Picks figure, which is relatively cheap, but I also have some plans for this, and I don't think I'm going to be keeping this figure this way, which is what's cool. This figure is severely underrated. It's kind of sad. Next up, man, we have a Johnny Gargano Elite 105. And if you look closely, Brad, it does have Johnny Gargano syndrome. He's not infected, so that's always a blessing. We love to see that, man. Always unscathed here. That's just, that's terrific. Also, if you hear some hoarseness in my voice, <clears throat> it's because I'm still recovering from the WrestleMania week. I developed, like, some awfulness in my throat, man. It's just terrible. But what else we got in here? All right, so we got some, okay, we have, it looks like we have this, like, bag full of accessories. So we got some world championships and, uh, oh, we got some tag titles in there. You got some, looks like some some uh, bloodline accessories, maybe some championship belts and everything like that going on. So pretty good. You got looks like a pair of SmackDown titles, a pair of Raw titles. You have some like Usos and Roman Reigns accessories. You got Solo Sokoa's towel, WWE Championship, Blue Universal Championship. Always love some good accessories. I feel like a lot of people who collect WWE figures really just enjoy a lot of accessories. Next up, we have the Monday Night Wars Hollywood Hulk Hogan figure. Very good figure here. I think another one of people's favorites out of that set. A little bit plain Jane, but. It's Certainly, you know, the Hogan fans come out and raise for this one. We have what looks to be, it looks like we have a what? I think this is the Roman undo it here. Take a look out of it. Okay, so we have the Logan Paul and Roman Reigns Championship Showdown Pack with the Blue Universal Championship. Now, now everything that's going to be for sale in this video is going to be in auction format, all starting at a dollar, no matter what the item is. And stay tuned because I'm about to announce the giveaway item. Moving right along, man, it looks like we have another Rey Mysterio, and it is the other top picks, man. They love to pump out Rey Mysterio. I mean, Rey Mysterio has so many figures. I can't imagine all the checks he gets for his action figures and all of the damn merch that this man has made, man. I cannot imagine. But we do have the batman theme Rey Mysterio. Another fantastic one. Kind of a repaint of the other one, but still just simply great. We got some fluff in here. I'm going to lay that down there, but we do have... Holy God in heaven, we have an entire bag worth, it looks like, of Usos or Bloodline figures. Let's dive into this. So the first figure we have is the SummerSlam Elite Jey Uso, who is now the number one contender for the World Championship after last night, but a very sweet figure. The Elite 106 Jey Uso with the cut shirt right there. It's got the crop top on there. A very good figure even though, you know, the legs are a little stiff to me, but I still like this figure a lot. I like this Jey Uso. We have Top Picks Jimmy, which is the God and gracious heaven. Dude, if that would have landed on me, that would have been awful. God in heaven. Let's take an ad break. Saturday, April 13th. 7 p.m. Central Time. Join me for my biggest whatnot stream ever. Not only are we selling everything we unbox in this video today, we will also be giving away a Mattel Creations exclusive Ultimate Edition Cody Rhodes figure. Also, April 11th through the 14th, Whatnot is running Whatnot Con, the world's largest virtual comic convention. Think of it like San Diego Comic Con, but online with over 1,300 exhibitors, including sellers, artists, celebrities, and studios like Marvel. They will have over 20 exclusive items and many other things available for purchase across all the different 
different sellers. If you click the link in the description below, you get a $10 coupon off your first purchase after downloading the WhatNot app. On this stream, I'm going to have mystery items, exclusive, never before seen customs, even on my YouTube channel, and many other items, all starting at $1 auction. So tune into my WhatNot Con stream this Saturday, April 13th, 7 p.m. Central Time. I hope to see you guys there. Huge thank you to WhatNot. Now let's get back to unboxing this mystery box. So we do have the Top Picks Jimmy. So, I mean, I know it looks like Jay. A lot of, I remember the controversy around this figure. Don't think I forgot, Brad. Great figure nonetheless. We also kind of have like a repaint of that figure or the first time around. This is the Elite 95 Jimmy Uso, which again was pretty much Jay Uso. Then we also have the Elite 90 Jay Uso in here. I also want to know down in the comment section below at the end of the video, man, let me know if you think everything in this box is uh, is worth up to a thousand bucks. I'd also like to know that. We have the other side of Elite 106 with Jimmy Uso. So we have a ton of Bloodline figures in here, man. Ton of Bloodline, ton of Usos. Great stuff. And then we also have the Elite 107 Solo Sokoa figure to go with our Elite 106 Usos. That's a damn good figure too. It's got the updated torso and everything like that. And the last figure in that bag was the Fix Up Monday Night with Seth Rollins. Now the money spent on the parts to create that figure, that updated formula, you know, the this is the one we did on surgery. This figure was built using those parts, so we did make a Monday Night Rollins on the updated Seth Rollins formula. Dive back in here. What else do we have? It looks like we have another bag, and it looks like this may be the Ultimate Edition Taker. Yes, it is the Michael Jackson Ultimate Edition Undertaker right there. This figure's, you know what, switch out the head sculpt, and this figure has some good stuff going on. The head sculpt's really the only thing that takes me out, but it does have all of his accessories here in this bag. Next up, we have the Elite 105 Johnny Gargano yet again, and again, no Johnny Gargano Syndrome, man. Beautiful. And a lot of the mid on card figures in this thing are kind of beat up, so we're probably going to have these things loose. I mean, like, look at this card right here, man. It's all beat to hell. Unfortunate. But I don't mind it, because it's a damn good figure. Next up, we we have another bag full of WWE figures. Now, first up, we do have this promo gear Logan Paul figure with the Carmelo Hayes coat. Now, this started off as an AEW Supreme figure or AEW Unrivaled figure, but the skin tone was so bad in matching. It's still mismatching, but I think this one may look better, but I'm putting it in. This is how the, it will appear on the stream. It's going to be this custom Elite promo gear Logan Paul figure. We also have the Elite 104 Solo Sokoa. I know the torso is not great, but I don't know. You could use it as a thinner solo, man. You know, maybe he lost weight. Maybe you want to cut him up a little bit. Or maybe you don't care about the torso. Here's another Solo Sokoa in the Elite 104. We also have another Roman Reigns basic figure. Not going to set the world on fire, but came with that Logan Paul. So what do you want? Now, this Paul Heyman figure, I think I'm going to do a custom on this. This was revealed in the next From the Vault series number two. So I don't think I'm going to keep the figure like this. I think I am going to change it up quite a bit here. But And that's why you need to come to the stream too because... God! Why? Why? And that's why you need to come to the stream too, because a lot of these items are going to be custom made. Some will come as they are, but there's going to be a lot of surprises in the stream with some mystery items and exciting things, man. So be sure to check out Whatnot down in the link in the description below. We also have a suited body. Now the body is not going to come like this. This is going to be a custom suited body, which you guys will find out at the stream. So come by, man. It's going to be beautiful. Always love a good suited body Build-A-Figure, man. We have the Elite 103 Tribal Chief over here looking pretty damn good, even though he did lose the championship. Come on. One, two, three. And then we have an Ultimate Edition Jeff Hardy figure, which is cool. And he comes with all of his goods right here. Oh, wait, that's the other hands. He comes with his goods, and you get all the interchangeable hands with all those Usos and Solos and Roman Reigns figures. All right, man, next up, we have another big bag full of loose figures. Let's run through right here. We have the regular edition of the Mr. T referee basic figure. We already sold the chase, so now we get the regular edition. We also have the HLR black attire basic Cena with the new formula or the new basic series going on. It's got the bicep band, the hat. The hat doesn't come off, but he's got the You're Killing Me Smalls, you know, Doug Bill hat on. But pretty cool basic, man. I actually like this basic a lot. We have the AEW Unmatched Series 8 Malachi Black in the black suit, a very underrated figure right here. I love the promo gears, man. They're the best. Dang, we have another Logan and Roman battle pack. So maybe. I could maybe I can make something work right here. Maybe it won't be the same exact figures. You have to come by the Whatnot stream and find out. And then finishing up that bag, we have the Elite 106 Jimmy Uso with the slick back hair. So not the straight down hair, but he's like, you know, the wet or mid-match style Jimmy Uso Elite 106. And look at that, man. It is the greatest hits updated skin tone ultimate edition Hollywood Hulk Hogan, man. Seems like yesterday they released the regular version, and now we have this greatest hits updated tan version. Pinless and all the good bells and whistles. Unbelievable. And I think this is the last loose figure we have right here. And it is the top 
picks world heavyweight or undisputed champion. We have the American Nightmare Cody Rhodes. Love this figure. Always love Cody figures. Love Cody. I am a proud Cody crybaby. They almost made me cry winning that championship the other night. Great figure. Next up, we have a beat to hell Trash Corbin Elite 99. Now, oh. now my plan for this is actually I'm going to be making this into a Trash Corbin like he appears on the channel. So I'm going to be attaching this man to a trash can in some way and selling it. So if you guys want to Trash Corbin officially, here's your opportunity. We also have the Elite 106 Pauleth Bearer figure. Beautiful figure. Feels fantastic in the hand. Just an, uh, just a, a, a dream figure. A dream figure. I love this Paul Bear so much. Hate to say it's not the chase, but it's still a great figure. Next up is the Undertaker from Monday Night Wars. Now, my plan for this is actually going to be taking the head sculpt off of this and putting it on the Ultimate Edition. So you're going to have the opportunity to have an Ultimate Edition Monday Night Wars Undertaker figure. And then I will put one of those head sculpts over here, and so you'll have an Elite Undertaker to purchase. Finishing up the Monday Night War set is the Scott Hall. Now, this Scott Hall is going to have the updated vest. This one's flat and not dry brushed. I'm going to customize the vest and dry brush the details on there. And he'll come with the WCW microphone. But this, this figure is not that bad. I know it gets a bad rep, but it's really the lack of details on the vest and like a couple different minor things. But you can really fix this figure up and make it look amazing. We also have the Royal Rumble Elite Vader. Underrated figure right here. Got a great deal on this one. Vader time on there. Who doesn't love big man Vader with the double jointed arms? We have Mr. World Champion himself, Damian Priest in the all white and silver. Very underrated piece right here, man. Damian Priest has not had a bad figure yet, and I don't know if he will, right? He had the Elite 89, I think it was. He had this figure. Now he has that Elite 109 figure that looks just like him. Now he's world champion. Dude is living life. He's killing it right now. We also have the Unrivaled 13 Darby Allen figure. I think this is the most updated Darby Allen in terms of tattoos. So this is probably the best one you can grab right now for money. And these figures are so insanely deposed. They're amazing. All right, man, let's keep moving things forward because we also have our envelope and our giveaway item. We have a brother love figure in white suit. Love a white suited figure, and this figure was very, very cheap on Amazon. So I figured, get this guy, fix him up a little bit, and make him something. We have the Survivor Series Shawn Michaels doo-doo tights. Yeah, doo-doo tights, Shawn Michaels. Still wanted this figure for so long. Has the World Heavyweight Championship schoolboy haircut. We have McDonald's All-American Ultimate Edition Bobby Lashley, man. I feel like I ne I've never seen this at retail space, so got it online, decided to throw it in the mystery box. United States Championship. Who doesn't love a good McDonald's All-American? We also have the Greatest Hits Undertaker based on the Hall of Champions Undertaker, which was a lovely figure, but this one has a better head sculpt. Also, the card's all damaged, but who cares? It's not the biggest deal. Going to be opening this guy up. World Tag Title in there. Great figure. And then we're coming down on the last ones, man. We do have the Greatest Hits Shawn Michaels, another fantastic figure, and a figure that poses around with the best of them. This is a great inclusion in the Greatest Hits line. I'm very glad they chose to pick this one. And the last figure in here, Besides the envelope and the giveaway item is the tribal chief himself, Roman Football Reigns. And this figure is so good. I love it, even though it does come with the bummy head sculpt. You do have Roman Reigns here in Ultimate Edition form. Who doesn't love the Tribal Chief? 1,300 plus days as champ. Unbelievable run. Maybe the greatest title reign of all time. So for our giveaway item on our Whatnot stream, it is going to be this Ultimate Edition Cody Rhodes figure, man. The American Nightmare finished the story at WrestleMania, and now you can own the Mattel Creations exclusive Ultimate Edition Cody. Cody Rhodes figure, man. Excited to give this away on the Whatnot stream, so be able to swing by and, you know, have your hand at this, man. All you gotta do is be following me on there and be in the stream when I do the giveaway. All I have to do is be following me on Whatnot and then be there in the stream when the when the giveaway goes live, and that is it, man. So let's get into our last little envelope of stuff that is gonna be sold on the stream. But for our last item, man, we have this envelope here shiny envelope and in here is some things of massive epic proportion all right man so here we go we do have our envelope I'm pulling them out here man look at this one of the championships is going to be available, man, is some replica elite championships based on the MDT Pick Fed and the MDT Elite Championship. These are made by Dan Turnquist. They have the clip on there. These are 3D printed. They are painted beautifully. And this is only the first title that we have available. The next title that we're going to have is the Undisputed Championship. And there are going to be multiple copies of these. I do not know the exact number of copies, 
But we have multiple copies of these different championships. So this is the second one. We have the Undisputed Championship here that Cody Rhodes just recently won. The next championship is the MDT Championship here, man. And the design right here is actually based on the original look of the championship, which is the gold or yellow lettering here. Beautiful title. Zebra stripes on the strap. Unbelievable. The next title is the World Heavyweight Championship here that Damian Priest holds. And it doesn't have any specific side plates on this or the Undisputed. That way that you can, you know, put it on whoever you want. So you don't have to worry about, you know, it not matching or what have you. Like, the WWE logo is fine on there. You can put it on whoever becomes champion. I think it's a beautiful piece. These are beautiful championship belts, man. Handcrafted. But there is going to be a limited supply of each championship on the stream, man. So come by and check these out. But I want to stack up and gather everything that we have here so we can take a look at everything that we got out of this mystery box and find out if it was indeed worth the thousand bucks. All right, man, so here's everything out of our mystery box, and I think it was a pretty good turnout, all things considered, man. We got a lot of value here. Cannot wait to see you guys on the WhatNot stream. Be sure to go down there and download it. Link in the description below, man. You get the free $10 credit. So cash in that money in the bank briefcase like we're always talking about here, but we have a bunch of figures here for sale, and of course, this is not everything. This is just everything out of the mystery box. So there are going to be mystery items. There are going to be some surprises in there. So, But this was a very fun video, and I cannot wait to see you guys over there. This Saturday, April 13th, bookmark the stream over there following the link. Should be an epic turnout, man, but I'm getting out of here. Thank you guys so very much for watching. Huge shout out to our Patreon members of the MDT YouTube channel, man. Thank you guys so very much for your continued support, man. Love each and every single one of you guys. But I'm getting out of here. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to the channel. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok on My Damn Toys. I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a blessed one, and I'll catch you next time.